What's going on everybody? How's everybody doing out there? Well, today I'm in Monon, Indiana, and I'm at the Monon Connection Museum and the Whistle Stop Restaurant. I've been told that it's a guided tour that lasts over an hour, and I really don't have an hour, so we're just going to grab a quick bite to eat. But I can show you real quick what the inside looks like, but not the guided tour section. And we'll go ahead and walk the grounds. A lot of pieces of equipment on the grounds we can take a look at real quick. So let's take a look. We'll start by going in the diner and whatever you can see of the museum portion. I'm going to have to do some music over this because they're playing loud country music throughout the facility. Well, that was pretty good. I had the patty melt as you've seen and a quick tour around the uh, museum Now we're going to take a quick tour around the grounds and there's a lot to see around the outside here We can start right here with this maintenance of way beautiful crane and flatbed She is a beauty You Cyrus crane company flat bed with a smaller crane and a wheel set back of the crane is awesome almost looks like a locomotive quick peek at the other side the gear that swivels that cab is just humongous it's great
Here's one of the older crossing signals where the stop sign used to flip. So it would flip this way when it said stop and the lights would light up. At the entrance they got an old wigwag. gates into the parking lot got this little battery operated motor type thing I don't know if this was what this actually was for or where it was used it's still kind of cool we got semi fours placed all around here so you're probably seeing them in the background as we go it's a few interesting pieces on this back side that's one of them right there it's like a dump, a dump, a side dump. And they've got a little giant crane sitting here. Good old maintenance away equipment. I actually remember this as a kid running through town once in a while. Here's another dump cart. Got a nice flat bed from the Monon Railway. And this down from that is a boxcar from the Monon. Beautiful Monon wooden caboose. And they've got over here a couple wooden boxcars. Here's a better look at it from the back side. I think what's interesting about this museum and diner, it's literally in the middle of nowhere. In Indiana. But what's funny is the town of Monon is only about a mile and a half down the road. Slightly better look at the boxcar without the bus being in the way. And a little better look at the wooden boxcars. That one actually looks like a reefer. It doesn't have the original roof on it, so I can't see if it's got ice hatches. Good semaphore above it. Oh, this signal's beautiful. Look at that. In the middle of the parking lot they got this beautiful Wabash caboose and it looks like you can go in it so let's take a quick tour through the caboose yes the door is open oh this is beautiful wow all the wood has been stained beautiful pot belly stove with a lantern on it hot water tank Walk down the hall towards the cupola. Now towards the back. Looks like there's an ice box back here. Look at that. Little closet area back here. And right out to the brake wheel. That's beautiful. Very, very nice interior. Let's see what else is here. So all down through the parking lot, they've got different signs, crossing signals. There's a cart. All kinds of things. I mean, they just have everything. A little bit of everything here. Got an awesome wig wag right at the entrance to the restaurant. And a couple more signals. Looks like there's a couple semi fours right there. Now on this side of the parking lot, they've got a small depot. It says Cove on it, Railway Express Agency. Now I've not seen a signal like this before. A little spoon shaped thing. And they've got various things sitting around, another semi four. Here's a couple shells of speeders. Four little guys. Oof. Definitely seen better days, lots of traffic. I don't know if this is a real deal water tower or if it's just a mock-up. But I love this crane situation right here. It'd be like a crane you'd find in the yard. They just pull the car up under it and it'll be hand operated. They got a few things down the line past that caboose we'll take a look at real quick. Great little hand car right there. It'd be fun to take a trip on one of them. Pretty cool. They got switch levers as the entrance railings to the step that's awesome 
I've got another beautiful Monon caboose. Let's take a peek in the window. The door is not open. Let's take a look. The interior of this one is beautifully preserved as well. That's very nice looking. Here's a quick look of the back side of the line. I go out front and take a quick look. To get these cars right here, these are very interesting. I'm not sure what kind of cars or what they were used for back in the day. Some sort of dumping car. I don't know if it's ore, maybe. Somebody will know. Okay, so we'll start right here at the red caboose and we'll work ourselves down the line. Like I said, that caboose inside was really nice. There's another Moonon flat car with an old antique combine on it. I would picture loads like that back in the day. And an old steel wheel farm or tractor. That's beautiful. Let's get a close up of this. Wow. And it got the job done back then. Helped build America right there. Got an L and N flat car sitting here with an old John Deere cedar. Bet you I planted many a corn back in the day. And an old ride behind plow. Oh yeah, I would till the dirt up good. Look at the spikes on that thing. And last but not least, at the end of the line is this Monon steel box car. This whole lineup is beautiful, it's worth the stop. Awesome place. Well, there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed the quick little stop of the Monon Connection Museum here in Monon, Indiana. Stop and had a quick bite to eat. Sorry I didn't have the time to do the inside tour all the way, but I definitely got to get moving and i couldn't take the hour tour but what i seen the place is pretty interesting but the outside equipment was pretty awesome sorry i fire hose through it all but i got to get on down the road and i hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless all right till next time like share subscribe don't cost nothing hit that button till my next adventure happy out